Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Tarot. I hope everyone is well. So, it has come time to throw down the cards for October. Libra, it is your season. We will start with you. This reading will be for Libra, Sun, and Rising Venus. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given you by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it doesn't resonate, that's okay too. Check your moon, rising, or Venus sign readings. You may find something that might resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. And all things can and maybe vice versa and might play out from the perspective of a cross watcher. And our dear friends, the cross watchers are always welcome here. Alright. Couple more shuffles. We'll throw them down. Pentacles reversed. Libra, by the looks of things, you're no longer putting work into something. Okay. Hmm. All right. Let's catch your energy, the energy of the person that you're dealing with. Obstacle. Potential resolution, projected outcome. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Oh, well, the six of cups reversed. Hmm. There's salty feelings involved here, isn't there? <clears throat> if you have fe salty feelings toward them, or you feel like they have salty feelings toward you. Take it however it resonates. What do you think of them? Knight of Wands in reverse. Hmm. You do not see them as a person of action. Maybe you see them as kind of a standstill. Hmm. What do you want from them? The Nine of Pentacles in the reverse. Mmm. Possibly you wanted to feel needed. That's what I just heard. How do they feel? Do they feel about you? Ten of Pentacles in the reverse. They are not seeing this as potentially abundant. Hmm. What do they think of you? Ace of Pentacles in reverse. Hmm. That house plant got put on the back deck, didn't it? Hmm. What do they want from you? King of Pentacles in the reverse. Mm, I'm going to throw a clarifier on that. I just heard and I sensed somebody wasn't all they were cracked up to be.
Hmm. Right, what's the conflict here? Ace of Cups. Somebody found something new. Could have been you, could have been them. Okay. What's the potential resolution? Three of Pentacles in the reverse. Mm. It's only one reverse three. We'll throw a clarifier down and see if another one pops up. Potential resolution could be accepting that this just wasn't meant to form a solid foundation. Huh. All right. Let's save this card for the end. Let's throw some clarifiers down. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards and people for Libra? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, please. For the month of October 2020. Libra, October 2020. And yes, I counted and made sure they were all there. For those of you who saw the work week top and bottom of the deck reading. <laughs> <coughs> I had half a deck hiding in my Illuminati deck. Seriously. Half the clarifier deck was hiding in another deck. <sighs> it's okay. I think they still worked for their purpose. I just wasn't playing with a full deck. Get back over there. King of Swords reversed. Hmm. Yeah, stopped putting in the work something stopped putting work into something and have a bad attitude toward the situation, okay? Uh, I know what the Six of Cups... I know what that's trying to say. We're not going to clarify that. Maybe I am. The lovers in the reverse and the seven of pentacles popped out. Okay. We'll lay it on top of that. Salty feelings because somebody's feelings weren't as strong as the other person's. I think you waited it out for a little bit, though, with that Seven of Pentacles. <clears throat> Maybe part of you is still waiting, Libra. Why is the Knight of Wands reversed here? Queen of Wands in the upright. <laughs> One more on that. Six of Cups reversed again. not necessarily a person of action, but they act when they want to act. And they do what they want when they want. That is the Queen of Wands. Nobody pushes the Queen of Wands around. Absolutely not. When she sits, she sits. When she's up and moving, she's up and moving. You will not bend her. You will not break her. She is what she is. And still the salty feelings. Hmm. Why is the Nine of Pentacles reversed here? <clears throat> mm. 
<laughs> the wheel of the year. Hmm. Okay. The wheel of the year. It can be a card that represents karmic connections. Possibly you wanted to complete the circle. You wanted them to need you as much as you needed them. You wanted to feel needed. You wanted to complete the circle. I just keep hearing complete the circle. Complete the circle. I don't know why. The moon. The moon in the reverse. You want things to be exposed and illuminated in the daylight so you can see them. You want to see the forest on the other side of the trees. You want to know why. Perhaps there's things that need to be illuminated. Okay, why is the Ten of Pentacles reversed here for how the other party feels about Libra? Hmm. Ace of Swords. You may have been like a breath of fresh air for them. I'm sorry. Yeah, how the other person feels about Libra. Ace of Swords and Nine of Cups. You brought them happiness. You brought them joy. You filled their cups. You're like a breath of fresh air, but there was no abundance. They didn't see the happy ending. They didn't see the, rain the rainbow and the pot of gold at the end of it. They just couldn't see it. Why is the Ace of Pentacles reversed here? All the pentacles are upside down. Every single one of them. They're all upside down. Ten of wands. The house plant got put out on the back porch. It, it was too burdensome. It was too much. Maybe they think you were too much. Could be. One more. One more. Ah. <clears throat> Page of Pentacles reversed. Stagnancy. I just heard no apologies. I don't know if that means anything to anybody. If that's setting off alarms in anybody's head, and no apologies. Possibly they thought you were rather unsympathetic. Could be. Another upside down pentacle, too. Wait. This one's right side up. Card of Patience. Hmm. Sorry, I started doing the numerology in my head. Why is the King of Pentacles reversed here? Ooh. Hanged man. Nine of Swords. Two of Wands reversed. Hanged man is in the reversed as well. What the other person wants from Libra.
nothing to offer. Wow, that's cold. They want you to be as stuck as they are, Libra. They want you to be as stuck as they are. This makes more... The upside down king of pentacles makes more sense now. <clears throat> He's stuck. Can't move. Can't go nowhere. Nine of swords, hangman reverse, two of wands reverse. That's stuck. Stuck all up in your head about it. Staying up late at night can't move from it emotionally. Wow. Okay. Why the Ace of Cups? Star reversed, five of swords upright. Lack of healing, lack of closure, possibly things going on behind closed doors. That's one of the meanings of the five of swords is behind closed doors. New love, someone new came in possibly. Could be for some of you. If it's not yours, leave it. It doesn't resonate, don't take it with you. You'll know if it's yours or not. That don't go accusing anybody of nothing, okay? It's a conflict. A healing didn't take place. Hmm. Well, of course, they're salty feelings. Why is the Three of Pentacles reversed here? For the possible resolution. Well, you just went flying out, didn't you? Five of Cups reversed. One more. Hermit reversed. King of Cups reversed. Allow yourself to come out of your state of sadness, emotionally closing yourself off from it. Well, that's not good. I don't see that as a resolution, but you know, I'm not the cards. One more. I'm not taking 10 cards. But the Ten of Pentacles reversed was on the top, so I'll take that one. Accepting that the foundation was never going to be solid, that there was never going to be a pot at the end of the rainbow. Allowing yourself to come out of that state of sadness. Accepting that it wasn't the cup. It wasn't your cup. Allowing the hermit to come in and allow you to heal. You haven't healed yet. Allow for the healing. But part of that healing process is acceptance. Okay. Projected outcome. Seven of Wands. Regaining control. Ten of Swords, the sun shining again. It's not a bad outcome. That's not a bad outcome at all. You've already come to the decision that you're not going to put work into it anymore. You're already there. 
but it's the attitude that you might need to check. I can understand when you hurt, bad attitudes have a tendency to come out. I, I feel that. I feel that totally. Right, let's take some advice off the bottom. Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups upright, Eight of Swords reversed. Come out of that cage of your own thoughts and allow yourself to move forward on the path. That's all you can do. Cups still standing. It's not bad. Four of Pentacles upright. Two of Pentacles upright. Four and two is six. It's okay to hold on. It is. But hold on to the good stuff. Enough with this six of, you know, the six of cups jazz uh, in the reverse. Enough of that. Let go of the salty feelings. Hang on to the good stuff. And allow yourself to come back into balance. It's a beautiful thing. Okay, Libra, this is what I have for you for October. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for coming by. I'll be back in a couple of weeks for your next reading. I haven't yet decided if it's going to be a mid-October or if it's going to be a November. I'll be honest. Schedules around here are still a little bit crazy. We're still leveling off from shifts and Mercury retrogrades coming up and I'm suffering from the Mars retrograde, unfortunately. As you might be able to tell, my voice is breaking up a little bit. So, <clears throat> again, namaste, my friends. Be blessed. Take care. Be kind to one another and be kind to yourself. And I'll see you next time.